Barbershop. Won't you come on over with me? <laughs> All right. You know, it's been a long time since I've been to Lancaster, but it's great to be back here and see all the great fans who have come out tonight. I just want to thank you personally for such a great show of, of you know, people coming out to see us and to see me. And man, it really makes my heart just sing, man. I, this is really, really great to see all you great people out here from Lancaster. So, without further ado, I welcome you to another edition of The Barber Shop. My guest is going to be a local uh, up-and-coming, I'm told, uh, the man, uh, they call him King of Pain, and I don't really know that much about him. You know, I've met a few kings, a few dukes, and a few princes during my travels. But this young man reminds me more of a queen than a king. No, no offense to you nice ladies out there. So let's all welcome my guest, King Payne. The last man that sat in that barber's chair ended up bald. I've seen all your crazy stuff over the years. This is not happening to me. You ain't suckering me into one of your haircuts. I'm not like all these peons here that let you, let them sit here and let you cut their filthy hair. They might come over here. They're not here to see you. They're here to see me. It's been a long time since you've been around, son. Look, you, you're, you're the past. I'm the present. There's nothing that they want to see you do but walk back to Tampa, Florida and sit and cut your own hair. Well, 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 Mr. Payne. You know, I gotta tell you, I, I think these people are really great. These are my fans, the greatest fans in the country, in the world. So I take offense when you start criticizing them. But since you're such a, you have such a high opinion of yourself, well maybe why don't you tell us a little about yourself and what makes you so great? You need to sit there, such, shut your mouth, and listen to King Payne when he's talking. I'll tell you why I'm great. Every single night I go in that ring and I show the so show everybody here, everybody around the world that watches my fantastic King Pain matches on YouTube that watch me from my homeland that is undisclosed because I don't want you guys following me or where I stand. The thing is, I am not old. I am young. I am fresh. I hit the gym. Kinda like you, but not like you used to. You used, you used to be this good, oh, great professional wrestler back in your heyday. But this ain't the heyday anymore, Beefcake. You're in King Payne's world. And when King Payne tells you to leave, you will leave. There's nobody, not that stupid idiot Jimmy Fahrenheit, not... No, 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 no. You are not going to come out here and disrespect this man. This man is a legend. This man cut Jimmy Hart's hair. This man's about to be in the Hall of Fame. Wow. Yeah, I, I, I did cut just about everybody's hair in the WWF during these days. Uh, definitely. Definitely made everybody look, give them just a little bit more class, made them just look a little bit better. 
because of my special touch. And I appreciate those good words. Sir. I was thinking that maybe you two might want to get together later this evening and, and, and have a match, kind of work out these, work out these aggressions. Let's really see who the man is, if you're as great as you say that you are. Just remember one thing, King Payne. Tonight, you're going to feel the heat. Wait a second. Whoa, 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 whoa. He, he, he can leave. I, I'll do the match under one condition. If I defeat him, you, Brutus the Barber Beefcake, not Jimmy Fahrenheit, has to bow at the king's feet and kiss them. You're so confident that Jimmy Fahrenheit and all your peons of fans are here because of you and Jimmy Fahrenheit, then maybe you will accept that challenge. That's pretty interesting. Uh, I guess I will take that challenge. All right, well, anyway, we all heard from King Payne. This would be pain just to look at <laughs> But I just want to thank everybody for watching and attending the latest edition of The Barber Show. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, will you please rise to your feet? No. Please stand up. No. 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 Look, I, I'm sorry. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise to your feet. No. For your king. No.
I will.